Good day coders, in this video I'll take you to a step-by-step -step process how to deploy our Angular application to Firebase. So with the assumption that we've already created our Firebase project, so what we'll need to set up here is Firebase hosting. So you'll come over here, so you click on the get started. So this gives you like a step-by-step -step process to follow for you to actually deploy. So you first need to install like Firebase tools uh the next step here tells you that you need to go about logging in firebase uh, so you run a firebase login so this is using the firebase cli and then here yeah, just simply say no i don't think that's really important so i'll choose my account over here so i'll click on next next allow everything and yeah, so this should take me here. So let me just clear that. So what's the next thing that I'll just need to do is uh, because now I'm actually like logged in. So if we go back to Firebase and check out the instructions. So in the instructions here, this says I need to run just uh, Firebase in it. But I know in the Firebase in it, it'll need me to like specify which folder I want to deploy, which should be my build file. So we'll first go ahead and actually build our uh, project. So over here, we'll just run ng build. Okay. So with this ng build over here, let's just wait for it to actually finish up. Okay, so this actually ran like our actual ng build, but I see here we've got like a specific like error and this is in terms of like our actual budget. So this says uh, we've actually exceeded our budget. So over here, let me just see. If I say five kilobytes, right? So this should actually come here from our actual Angular. So this is Angular JS. So over here, I think this is the one. So I'll just make it two and then just clear and run the ng build again. Okay, so this should be able to actually run like our ng build and actually build our uh, Angular application. So once this is actually successful, what will happen over here, Angular will create this test folder which are, which consists of our actual project. So the next thing that we would then want to do is actually run this Firebase command, right? So this is going to be Firebase in it. Okay, so when you run the Firebase in it, what you'll need to do is I want to uh, set up my actual hosting. So this will configure files for hosting and optionally set up uh, Git actions. Okay, so once I click on that, oh, sorry, my bad. I need to run this again. I need to run this guy and this. So here I just want to use an existing pro uh, project. And the project that I'm going to use is this. Okay, so now I just need to specify the actual uh, directory, right, for my, uh, my actual public directory. So this should be dist forward slash polling, right? And then because over here, I need to actually target my index.html. So this should be forward slash browser so this is polling app for slash browser okay so configure as as a single application which will say yes over here and then do i want to get actions nope and then the file that already exists you want to override it nope um 
Okay, yeah, so that's basically what we need. So the next step over here is I just need to set up Firebase Deploy. So if I say Firebase Deploy, so this command should actually run this Firebase Deploy. So now let's actually wait and see what happens. So now it's actually trying to deploy. Yes, so that's done. And now I can just go ahead and actually access my Firebase app. Yeah, so this is basically it. So let me just try it out and actually see if I can still run everything smoothly. So I'll just try to log in over here. Yeah, so you see over here, this is logging me into my actual application and I'll just go ahead and create right so uh, which cloud provider do you love so here i'll just say uh, gcp azure or i'll say aws so this will create so over here if i actually create in my home i should have the ability to actually see this so as you can see we've actually easily deployed our angular application to uh, firebase so if you like this video and you're new please don't forget to like share and subscribe